found out about uh, the many scholarship opportunities that the History Department has available uh, through a conversation with my academic advisor, and I also found out through the History Department's website. Uh, I found out about scholarship opportunities um, through the History Department um, by looking at their website. It's a really great source, and um, if you just go um, under scholarships, they have a whole bunch of them listed. I learned about scholarship opportunities through the History Department um, from several professors who had mentioned them in class and encouraged us to apply. The application process for the History Department scholarships is rather simple, actually, uh, since it's a unified application uh, and the only thing that you need to consider is adding additional information based upon which scholarship that you're applying for. It was relatively simple, uh, very straightforward, and the most difficult part is just unifying everything into one PDF. Um, the one I applied for needed a personal statement and a statement of what you plan to do um, in the future, as well as a small um, timeline for what you thought um, you were going to do in the um, years to come, which I thought was um, a neat aspect because that was kind of different from some other ones. The application process was really minimal, I think, compared to other scholarships. I think all that was required for my scholarship was a resume, um, a completed application form, and a faculty letter of recommendation. So it was not a whole lot of added stress uh, compared to a lot of other scholarships. I am a recipient of the Guthrie Scholarship, and the Guthrie Scholarship has really helped me be able to focus on my studies and to not have to worry quite as much about paying for school. I'm not having to divide myself as much between uh, an additional uh, outside job that might not be related to my field, but I can really put my effort into what I'm studying. So I received the Alan R. Millett Study Abroad Scholarship, um, which I used to help offset the program fee for the World War II trip that I went on this past May with the History Department. So with that scholarship, it really took a lot of the burden off me to try to find the money to go on this trip. So the History Department really made this opportunity a lot more reachable for me. I received the Dr. Morris Frommer Award. Um, it was intended for people who were interested in studying abroad, which um, when I applied, I said that I was interested in studying abroad in Rome um, during the winter of 2017. My advice to other majors considering scholarships would be just go ahead and apply. It doesn't take a whole lot of time. It's already stuff that's you know readily available to you. And um, what do you really have to lose, I think? There's so many different scholarships available in arts and sciences and it's rather simple to apply for these things so definitely don't be afraid to. Uh, my main advice is just to go for it. You never know unless you try uh, and with an application process that's as simple as this one uh, you might as well throw your hat into the ring.